Hi everyone, happy Valentine's Day. Today, where I'm recording this, it is still a day early, but I want to wish you all a very happy Valentine's Day. And that doesn't include just couples. That includes friends, siblings, parents, your pets, everyone. I think love shouldn't be just categories as couples only. It's for our children and everybody. So happy Valentine's Day to you all. Today, uh, some very exciting things are happening. Well, maybe not for me, but kind of for me too. Some flowers are gonna be delivered to our daughter, Laura, from her sister, Jess, who lives in New Brunswick. And Fred is home, so I'm gonna to try to be quick about this. Um, Fred, everybody knows except Jess, that. Uh, everyone knows except Laura and Laura's not home so she's gonna have some beautiful flowers delivered sometime today and that is just a bell saying somebody's here that they drove up for Fred I got him some those chocolate oranges that used to get at Christmas time those balls and then you just smack them on the table he fell in love with those at Christmas time and he's just he's been looking for them ever since he did get a couple after Christmas but he couldn't find any, so I went on Amazon, and luckily, they were expensive, but he's worth it. And I got him four boxes of those, and those will last him a long time, because he just loves them, and I love him. I also got a, a card for him that I need to fill out. Uh, for supper, I'm not sure yet. I think we're just gonna go out or something. Um, Friday is actually Laura's birthday. She's going to be 37. So hopefully Jessica and Sam will be here. We'll do something, have a lovely meal. I still have to wrap some more presents of her. We didn't, we don't do too much anymore because we have a small house, but we got her some things that she asked for. And I think, yeah, Jessica and Sam are hopefully visiting this weekend. We'll do something will have a meal of her choice, um, whatever Laura wants. It's her birthday. As for cake, she hasn't said yet. Usually I make something like last year. Hi, honey. Hey. Last year, she, oh, he brought me um, Timmy's. Yeah. French vanilla and a sandwich for, for breakfast. Oh, thank you. I'm just gonna wrap this up okay. and to say hi to our friends. How you doing? <laughs> so I'm just telling them, everybody about what our plans were, Laura's birthday and Valentine's Day, and I still have to wrap presents up today for her and everything. And it's gonna be a meal of her choosing. And cake, usually she decides it's been brownie cakes for a long time. Just, you know, like you make brownies and like two big brownies and you put chocolate mousse in between them and decorate it and that's what she really loved last year i believe it was i made a three layer cheesecake um like it was like dark chocolate white chocolate and medium chocolate i guess or just milk chocolate it was really good it was really difficult to make too um if i find a picture i'll insert it it was, it was so good, and I really hope she doesn't ask me to make that again. <laughs> if she did, I probably would, but it, it was difficult. It was the first time I ever made a cheesecake in my life, and I just went all out. But, yes, he brought me a French vanilla cappuccino and a Tim Horton sandwich, and we're going to have a little snack now. So when the flowers come, I'll try to get a picture of that and insert that as well probably at the end of this video or a clip at the end of this video i hope you all are having a fantastic day and happy valentine's day to you all talk to you next time bye bye here are the flowers the lovely lady she delivered the flowers for laura i think she thought it was laura's birthday but her birthday is in a few days anyway, so 
that's great she actually um, wanted to sing a happy birthday song and of course I asked her if I could video her and put it on YouTube and she graciously said yes so here it is Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Laura, happy birthday to you. Beautiful, thank you so much.